Up next, we're going to see someone defy the odds. It's triple threat action. I love a good triple threat. We have The Rock against two of WWE's toughest competitors. You know, this is the type of contest where everyone in the locker room is also watching. threat action like this in WWE. <laughs> this is going to be great. This triple threat match will be a main event on any show in any arena in any city across this nation. I assure you of that. his opponents first representing the new day from tampa florida weighing in at 285 pounds the wwe undisputed champion big e you know sometimes a superstar just has that look in his eye and this is one of those times this will undoubtedly be one of those smackdown matches you talk about for a long time to come Representing the infiltrators from San Luis Potosi, Mexico, weighing in at 239 pounds, Alberto De Rio. This guy will settle for nothing short of a victory here tonight. I don't see a clear favorite here. Any one of these three could legitimately walk away victorious. There's the bell, and Big E takes center stage. I'm interested to see what happens here with all 
three competitors in the ring. Will we see an alliance form? Don't take a bathroom break, folks. These triple threat matches can end in a hurry. Regardless, the multi-talented Big E always brings it, and tonight should be no exception. So what do you think about Big E? What, in your opinion, can we all expect from him tonight? Well, we have plenty of match left, or we should have plenty of match left. A former power lifter, Big E Langston has the power of a superhuman villain and the force of a speeding Mack truck. Clearly on a mission here. starting to slow down a bit here. He came into this match expecting a fight, and that's exactly what he's getting. I tell you, we knew this was going to be a close affair, but I don't think we expected it to be this time. What a match. And on top of that, John, these two guys couldn't be any more evenly matched at this point. Well, I've never seen him do that before. Spine on the pine. There's the finishing move. Don't know if you have anything left after that. It is so hard to stop that kind of strength. Come on, let's live in reality, shall we? When you're in there against two opponents, you need to pray for the best and be prepared for the worst. After a move like that, he's going to need a chiropractor in his near future. I don't like how slow he is to react right now. He has something in his eye on oh, the quick reversal there by Alberto Del Rio. He wants to do this in the ring. And I don't blame him one bit. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. All right, looks like he's in no man's land here. He needs to be able to put things back together here. Michael, this is a dangerous position to be in. He needs to be able to find a way to clear the cobwebs and regroup. You can practically feel the wear and tear that's been done throughout this match. The Rock may be in a bad way here. He can't rest on his laurels here. There are two other guys in there that want this match just as much as he does. Would you look at this guy? How many times is he going to do his finisher? It's not working. Move on. Oh, man. At this point, he might want to think about adopting a new finisher. He certainly hasn't finished anything here tonight. And there's the reversal. I'm not sure if he knows where he is right now. Watch it. Watch it. And what a reversal from Alberto Del Rio. Someone really should check out. I mean, a maneuver like that takes your career and it just flashes it before your very eyes. Yeah, that wouldn't be a very long flash for you, Cole, but this guy's in trouble. Back inside now. Man, this is one of those matches you just like to sit back and enjoy watching. Yeah, one of those you never want to see in. I just can't get over the physicality of this match. This has been brutal. Brutal and very, very painful for these guys. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. He's having a seriously hard time getting back to his feet after that. And I think it's clear that Big E is feeling the physicality of this match. There's a very real chance he might not be able to recover from this here in this triple threat match. Well said, Michael, but we've all seen him come back from worse beatings in the past. Yeah, you know, I'm thinking it might be a good time for him to switch up his game plan. Whatever he's been doing just isn't working right now. Every time he has to get up, it takes more and more effort. The offense of The Rock is working well right now. Boy, he is really tired now. 
That tank of his has to be reading empty. It has to be, King. But I still don't see him giving up. He's bleeding all over the place. This one's getting ugly. He needs to dig way down deep if he wants to keep going now. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. The more punishment he takes, the slower and slower he is getting back to his feet. Looks like he's having trouble staying in the ring. That's a German suplex, Cole. Are we from Berlin now? Yes. Boy, he is really tired now. That tank of his has to be reading empty. It has to be, King. But I still don't see him giving up. I've seen every episode of SmackDown over the years, and I assure you this one ranks right up there with the best. Oh, his body has to be broken right now. And it's The Rock with the reversal. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. You can shoulders down. And the shoulders up now. That's a kick out. Nice. Just when you thought it was over. Wow. The Rock works his way out of trouble. Well, you talk about a lightning fast counter, Cole. Oh, no. Here we go. Spine on the pine. Wow. Please tell me not the only one who felt that impact. This is pure physical domination. It is just awesome. It's nearly impossible to deal with this type of power. Well, this might be the worst yet. The Rock is in position. It hurts just watching it again. Ouch. What? He's still not through? I don't think so. Man, he's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously wrong there. has taken so much out of this guy he's not gonna give up but man this has been physical the rock turns it around he's too busy bragging and posting the battle into this matchup boy he is really tired now that he thinks he has it Here's your winner, The Rock. He gets a victory here tonight. Love him or hate him. Jason Jordan, the phenomenal AJ Styles. Up next, John, we have singles action. Oh, boy. It'll be AJ Styles against Jason Jordan. <laughs> oh, man. I can't wait to see these two go at it.
And his opponent, from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 245 pounds, Jason Jordan. Oh boy, we're in for a treat tonight. Both of these superstars look geared up and ready to go. The Atlanta crowd really looking forward to seeing this one. You can feel the electricity running through this arena. This is going to be some battle, one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano. Have you guys seen all the trash talk on social media lately? Let's just say some things were said there that, well, would make a sailor blush. It's go time, people. And one last thing, these Hotlanta fans are ready for some hot action, and it looks like they're gonna get it. Oh, geez, he might need to change his drawers after that one. Tell us about AJ Styles. It's anybody's guess, I know, but what do you expect from him here? We're going to find out a lot here tonight. Head to head, no excuses. Let's get it on. Well, the WWE Universe is filled with amazing talent, as this match definitely shows. He's not looking like himself here, but he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has to do to rebound. But it's important to know that this match has been so evenly contested so far. You really can't pick a winner. Yeah, but he's got to remember that matches are won inside the ring, not outside. Six. And it's imperative he gets back in the ring right now. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. I can't blame him. Keep it in the ring. What a slam! He was able to reverse that. Look at Jason Jordan. It's coming. Looks at AJ Styles trying to do differently at this stage to stay in this thing. I'd say he's starting to feel the pressure a bit. Got the ankle. Submission attempt here. He's trying to escape. But the more energy he expends, the closer he is to being out. We got a cover. Tremendous damage to the neck. Good Lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. AJ Styles with the offense. Missing the target. Yeah, it looked like it was completely out of desperation. AJ Styles has taken a lot of damage. I'm not sure how much he has left in the tank. AJ Styles' legs are looking weak right now. He could be on his way out of this one. You can almost see the confidence starting to drain from his face. Jeez, this is not a very good spot for him to be in right now, John. 
He's got to find a way to insert his dominance back into this match. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. When he gets going like this, there are a few better. And I think he's begging him to bring it. Oh, look out. We're taking this thing to the floor. Yeah, and it's real dangerous out here. He almost took his head off with that lariat. Uh-oh. He's in position, ready to strike. Oh, look at the emotion. Jason Jordan is looking to end this right now. Five. Six. He's certainly showing us something new Seven. from his repertoire. That's cool. I like new stuff. He's starting to stumble here. With these two guys, we all knew this was going to be an all-out battle. Perhaps more importantly, it's the amount of time he's spending outside the ring. At this point, he might find more success within the ropes. Yeah, but I wouldn't get too concerned for him. I still say he's in a very favorable position. Could this be it? I think so. Jason Jordan looked impressive tonight. Here's your winner, Jason Jordan. Naomi! Bailey! Trish Stratus! Hold on to your seats. We have singles action coming up next. I'm looking forward to it. It'll be Naomi against Trish Stratus. <laughs> oh, man. I can't wait to see these two go at it. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making your way to the ring, accompanied by Bailey from Orlando, Florida, Naomi. This one's going to be electric. Man, I can't wait to see these two square off in one-on-one -on -one action. And her opponent, representing the Bad Girls from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, Trish Stratus. Oh, the lovely Trish Stratus is coming down the aisle. Fans, when you're sitting at home and drawing up those fantasy wrestling cards, you're crazy if you don't put this one on it. There's the bell, and here we go. We're all along for the ride on this one, but make no mistake about it, we're going to have a winner. 
Yeah, and social media has been on fire ahead of this one. But now it's time to get down to business. Mono a mono, one fall will decide it. But hey, Naomi's here, so you know that fireworks are next. Bring it on. Let's quickly discuss Naomi for a moment. Hyper One will be interested to see how her game plan changes, if at all, now that she has a manager by her side. When it comes to athleticism, Michael, I'm not so sure there's another diva on the roster that compares to Naomi. It's matchups like this that make the WWE the most popular spectator sport in the world. Trish not looking her best right now. She doesn't want this lack of momentum to snowball. You said it, Michael. And these Divas have given us an incredibly even match contest up to this point. Yeah, but it's been a pretty even back and forth battle up until now. Naomi with a great offensive show. Wow, she's showing something different here tonight. I mean, this total diva has amazing body control, flexibility, agility, and power. Naomi is tough. In 2014, she wrestled with one eye after she suffered a fracture eye socket. Oh, wait, nice reversal. Oh, Naomi, I think she's got it when she wants to it. Stratus gets out of that one. Nice moves. Beautiful. And the move wasn't bad either. Nice reversal there. Naomi may get this, folks. An incredible dancer and competitor. We got a cover. One, two. And she raises her shoulder to interrupt the referee's count. She sure did. What a gutsy performance she's giving us tonight. There doesn't seem to be any slowing her down now. Stratus doing a great job of turning that around. Sweet. I don't want to know what that feels like. Yeah, well, I've felt it before, and you're right. You don't want to know. Chris Stratus gets out of that one. Nice move. Beautiful. And the move wasn't bad either. Naomi looking a little shaken, but you can bet there's still plenty of gas left in her tank. Her finisher hasn't been able to put her opposition away up to this point. Oh, man. If I had to pick a winner at this point, she might be it. And Trish makes the cover. Looking to steal one there, perhaps. Yeah, I think it's way too early in the match for that to work. I love a woman that shows passion. She's having a real hard time getting back to her feet. Trish Stratus looking totally worn out here. If she's not careful, she's going to end up losing this match. Color me surprised, Michael. Never in a million years did I anticipate this match being as closely contested as it has been. True. And let's not forget that she's utilized her finisher twice up to this point. And neither time was it enough to put her opponent away. A fever pitch is here in the WWE Universe. You're right about that. The crowd is buzzing. They're ready for the... Whoa, whoa! <laughs> With a move like that, she's just trying to insult her opponent. Playing my games. Yeah. A little intimidation there. Watch it! She's looking for it again. She is such a professional. She knows exactly what she's doing in there. Look at the attack here. Oh, man. Talk about a direct hit. Naomi going to work now. And they always showing us how to have a good time. For the pin and the win. Two. Oh, 
blow to the back of the net. Naomi gets out of that one. Nice move, Naomi. Ah, Naomi wants to fly. She appears to be extra slow regaining her base. Look at those eyes. Oh, yeah, this could be big. Oh, man, from the horrendous track. I wouldn't know what that's like. We're looking at complete domination here. Here's the cover for the win. Two. Oh, man, I thought that was it. Me, too. How did she kick out? She just will not go away. Moves like that can upset your opponent more than hurt them. It's got to be hard to rebound from that one. She's having a real hard time getting back to her feet. Oh, you son athlete. I'm not kidding. Here we go for the win. They, they got him. Oh, man, the resolve this diva is showing right now is absolutely unreal. Unreal? Come on, King. You know what she's all about. She appears to be extra slow regaining her base. Heads up! The sacrifice you must be willing to take to compete in the big leagues in the WWE is unreal. Oh, no! They hit me with a great offensive show. Adding insult to potential injury there. King, did she do it here? This may be it. Two, three. This singles contest has a victor. Here's your winner, Naomi. An emotional victory here tonight. Ma e S T Bell. Tamina. Hold on to your seats. We have singles action coming up next. This is going to be good. We have one of the best talents on the roster to date versus Tamina. <laughs> oh, man. I can't wait to see these two go at it. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring from Nashville, Tennessee, EST Bell. You at home have the best seat in the house for the singles action that is set to take place just moments from now. Yeah, this is going to be a great one. The entire Divas locker room has been talking about how she's been looking of late, and I have to agree.
and her opponent from the Pacific Islands, Tamina. Oh, I can't wait to see this one. I can't wait to see what happens when the bell rings and these two finally get to go at each other. The bell rings and Tamina looks eager to get to work as quickly as she can. Well, neither one of these competitors has a lot of love for the other. And that's going to become clear right about now. Two warriors, two superstars, two immense talents. I love it. But you know what? Guys, no matter the format or competitors involved, you know we're in for a great one here. Oh, it might be smart for the rep to call for the bell. That neck looks to be in bad shape. Tamina. What must she be thinking right now? She's someone who trusts her conviction and isn't afraid to make a bold statement. That's for sure. Tamina's looking good so far, Michael. But as you know, Divas matches can turn on a dime. It's way too early to predict a winner here. Hey, if you're not trying to stand out from the crowd, then you might as well just go home. I have no time for you. Whoa. The damage has been done. Going all the way up. That's a long way up. Looks like Tamina's starting to slip a bit, but I'd be surprised if she doesn't find a way back in control of this thing. <laughs> Look at these divas go. Neither one of them are backing down. Well put, John. I'd like to see how she reacts to, well, to the bit of adversity here. The entire complexion of the Divas division changed in 2010 when Tamina Snuka arrived in WWE. A second generation competitor, Tamina's the daughter of WWE Hall of Famer, Jimmy Superfly Snuka. She managed the Usos, was the bodyguard of AJ Lee, and has made it clear she has one goal, to be the Divas champion. Whoa, that was some reversal by Tamina. Well, that was some reversal by Tamina. Reversal. earlier the impact Tamina Snuka has had on the Divas division since her 2010 WWE debut. I'll put it a different way. There's never been a more intimidating force in the Divas division than Tamina. She's laid out Diva after Diva, furthering the Snuka family legacy. Yeah, Tamina's leveled every... Looking at it here. I think this is it. She's putting the entire Divas roster on notice here. She can't withstand much more punishment. There it is, the year you're a Nagi? Wow, that was impressive. Whoa, it could be over here. Yeah, maybe. Two, three. The cover. And this one's history. What a win. Here's your winner. Extremely impressive. The Phenomenal!
We have triple threat action coming up next. And this should be good. We have Kevin Owens in a match against two of WWE's finest. This is the one I've been waiting for. The following triple threat contest and his opponent first from Gainesville, Georgia. Weighing in at 218 pounds, the phenomenal AJ Styles. From the moment he stepped into WWE, the phenomenal AJ Styles has changed the face of WWE. Now tonight, he looks ready for action once more. Yeah, he really looks ready to go. The WWE Universe on its feet, looking forward to this great match. Representing the ministry from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 170 pounds, Kalisto. Here comes Kalisto. He'll be flying in here. This will undoubtedly be one of those SmackDown matches you talk about for a long time. And we're underway with triple threat action. Yeah, triple threat matches are absolute must-watch entertainment, always. Three superstars start the match, but only one of them will be left standing at the end. Regardless, people will look back on this night and tell stories to their grandkids about it. This kind of offense he's known for. Yeah, you're right about that. He's made a name for himself with this. Tell us about AJ Styles. He's got his hands full in this triple threat match. How does he climb that mountain? Got to have that head on a swivel here tonight. You never know where the attack might be coming from in a triple threat match. Doesn't get any more exciting or unpredictable than a triple threat match, folks. I promise you that. You have to respect that Kevin Owens knows what he wants and goes right after it. He's one of the most no-nonsense competitors we've seen in a long time. Yeah, but I'm not so sure Sami Zayn respects that. Kevin Owens wanted Zayn's NXT title and cut to the front of the line in February 2015 to take it. A sickening thud as he lands hard. You'd have to think that Kevin Owens' brawling style makes him incredibly difficult to game plan for. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. I don't like how slow he is to react right now. Just look at this man. He's all business. And that's the way he has to be if he wants to win here tonight. He's not exactly popping up to his feet here. 
Well, what do you expect, Michael? Did you see what just happened? Dishing out some serious punishment here. Ooh, that was stiff. Rolling out of harm's way. Smart strategy there. To your earlier point, Cole, there's no game planning for a guy who's going to come right at you like Owens does. The only thing I can think of is maybe run. Here's Styles. We got a cover. Is out of it. Looks like he's starting to sweat now. This is a dangerous spot for him to be here in this triple threat match. I thought this one was over when he used his finisher. Well said. And at this point, you have to wonder if he's going to go to his finisher again. He's having a seriously hard time getting back to his feet after that. Really pushing his opponent to the limit here. Kevin Owens connecting there with a good shot. And he touches that one. Kalisto gets out of that one. Nice move, Kalisto. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. And he's heading back in. I can't blame him. Here's your winner, the phenomenal AJ Styles. Impressive performance by all three competitors here tonight. You know, I don't recall ever actually being pinned, but you would have to think it's pretty humiliating. After that, I can't wait for the next time we have an opportunity to call a triple threat match.